Have you ever felt eyes watching you, even though you're completely alone? Imagine a place where the air feels thick with whispers and every shadow holds a secret. Throughout the world, there are forests so shrouded in legend and fear, they are said to be cursed. These woods are not just plots of land with trees. They are the epicenters of eerie tales and supernatural occurrences that have captivated human curiosity for centuries. Join us as we journey through the shadows of the world's most cursed forests. Imagine a forest so dense, even the sun dares not penetrate its depths. Welcome to Germany's Black Forest, a land shrouded in mystery and cloaked in an evergreen darkness. Here, the trees stand tall and foreboding, creating an atmosphere that fuels the imagination and stirs the soul with eerie tales. Delve into the heart of these woods and you'll find stories that have been whispered for centuries, legends of werewolves that roam under the moonlit sky, spectral figures that flicker between the trees, and haunting echoes that seem to come from nowhere. These tales, born from a mixture of fear and fascination with the unknown, have roots as deep as the forest itself. Historically, the Black Forest was a remote and inaccessible region, making it a perfect breeding ground for myths. Isolation led to tales that were passed down through generations, each adding their own twist, enhancing the forest's mystical aura. A place where folklore and darkness intertwine, the Black Forest holds its secrets tightly. At night, they say you can hear screams, but are they the wind or something far more sinister? Nestled in the eerie embrace of England, the Screaming Woods, also known as Pluckley Woods, are reputed to be one of the most haunted forests in Britain. This spectral haven draws the brave and the curious, all drawn by tales of chilling shrieks that slice through the dead of night. Witnesses have reported hearing these petrifying screams, along with the sounds of footsteps that follow no living walker. Documented accounts from locals and visitors alike speak of eerie figures glimpsed between the gnarled trees, vanishing before a second glance. Scientists have ventured explanations ranging from peculiar wind patterns whistling through the trees to auditory hallucinations caused by the sheer isolation of the woods. Meanwhile, paranormal enthusiasts argue that these phenomena are the work of spirits, perhaps of those who once met their untimely demise within the forest's dark confines. Whether myth or reality, the Screaming Woods continue to haunt the curiosity of adventurers and skeptics alike. Beneath Mount Fuji lies a forest with a somber reputation, woven into the fabric of modern folklore. Known as Aokigahara, this dense woodland is often shrouded in silence, a stark contrast to the vibrant life typical of most forests. Over the years, Aokigahara has become synonymous with tragedy due to the high number of suicides reported within its confines. Exploring the history of Aokigahara reveals a complex tapestry of cultural significance and personal despair. The forest's association with death is not just a recent phenomenon. Historical records suggest that the practice of ubasut, where elderly relatives were allegedly abandoned in remote areas, might have contributed to Aokigahara's eerie reputation. Today, the forest is approached with a respectful solemnity. Signs at the forest's entrance urge visitors to consider their families, seek professional help, and cherish life. This profound respect underscores the cultural impact of Aokigahara, serving as a poignant reminder of the human condition and the struggles many face in silence. Aokigahara reminds us that not all forests hide their darkness beneath the surface. Step into a forest where the world doesn't behave as it should, Nestled in the heart of Transylvania, Romania, lies Hoyabachiu, a forest shrouded in enigma and often referred to as the Bermuda Triangle of the country. This eerie woodland is infamous for its unsettling phenomena, from chilling ghost sightings to inexplicable lights that dance among the twisted trees. Local lore is rife with tales of visitors who vanish without a trace, only to reappear with no memory of their lost time. Whispered stories tell of eerie figures glimpsed between the gnarled branches and of voices that echo with no discernible source. Even more intriguing are the numerous reports of UFO activities, compelling both skeptics and believers to wonder what secrets this forest holds. Scientific investigations have tried to penetrate the mystery of Hoyabashu, employing everything from environmental studies to paranormal research, yet the forest retains its veil of mystery. Electromagnetic readings fluctuate wildly, 
baffling scientists and adding to the allure of this haunted haven. In Hoyabashu, every step could lead you into another dimension of fear. In the heart of New Jersey, a creature stirs, born of a cursed lineage. Welcome to the Pine Barrens, a sprawling forest that is as enigmatic as it is vast. Covering over one million acres, this dense wilderness is the legendary home of the Jersey Devil, a mythical beast that has haunted the area for over 270 years. Born of folklore and fear, the story tells of a creature birthed by Mother Leeds, a local woman who cursed her 13th child, only to have it transform into a demonic figure with hooves, a goat's head, and bat-like wings. Since the 18th century, numerous sightings have been reported, sending shivers down the spine of local communities and igniting a cultural phenomenon. The Pine Barrens are not just a hotbed for supernatural enthusiasts, they are also a canvas of American history painted with the brush of the unknown. The tales of the Jersey Devil have woven themselves into the fabric of local lore, influencing everything from the names of businesses to high school mascots. The Pine Barrens serve as a chilling reminder of America's dark folklore. Once a royal hunting ground, now a realm of whispered hauntings. Welcome to Epping Forest, a site deeply etched in the folklore and history of England. This ancient woodland has been the silent witness to centuries of history, from royal escapades to darker, more mysterious tales. Epping Forest's past is as dense as its woods. Once a favored hunting ground for English monarchs, this forest was alive with the clamor of royal hunting parties. But as the royal interest waned, the forest became the haunt of infamous characters, none more notorious than the ghostly highwayman, Dick Turpin. Legend has it that Turpin's spirit still roams these woods, especially near the area of his hideout at High Beach. The forest isn't just known for its spectral highwaymen. Visitors report eerie sensations, unexplained noises, and even fleeting visions among the ancient trees. The forest holds its secrets close, wrapped in layers of history and myth. Epping Forest, a historic site that whispers tales of the past into the ears of the present. Known as the most haunted forest in Britain, the daring woods have stories that can chill you to the bone. Nestled near the village of Pluckley, which itself has a reputation for being one of the most haunted villages in England, these woods are shrouded in mystery and fear. The air here carries whispers from the past, with locals and visitors reporting an unsettling number of ghost sightings, from shadowy figures darting between the trees to the eerie sound of footsteps following close behind the forest feels alive with unseen presences. The most notorious of these spectral phenomena is the chilling scream that pierces the quiet, giving the daring woods its ominous nickname, the Screaming Woods. Historians suggest that these screams could be echoes of a tragic past, possibly dating back to ancient battles fought in these woods, or from the lost souls of those who wandered into the forest and never returned. Are the screams of the past still echoing through these trees? In Massachusetts lies a forest that's a hot spot for the unexplained and the macabre. Welcome to a place where the trees whisper secrets of the past and every footstep feels like a descent into a darker world. This forest has long been a canvas for both criminal and supernatural occurrences that defy ordinary explanation. Legends whisper of cults that cloak themselves in the dense foliage conducting rituals by moonlight that are as eerie as they are arcane. These gatherings, shrouded in secrecy, leave behind symbols etched into the trees and faint echoes of ancient chants that disturb the silent air. Then there are the sightings, bizarre, inexplicable visions of creatures that belong neither to our world nor to our understanding. Travelers and locals alike tell tales of glowing eyes watching from the shadows and ghostly figures that vanish when approached. Reports of such encounters have woven a tapestry of fear and fascination that covers every inch of this mysterious woodland. This forest isn't just cursed, it's a nexus of dark activities. As we've seen, these forests aren't just plots of land, they're tapestries of fear and intrigue. Each forest, shrouded in its own cloak of darkness, tempts the brave and the curious with its eerie silence and whispered legends. Yet, why do people feel compelled to enter these haunted woods, knowing the risks and the chilling tales that echo through their ancient trees? The allure of these cursed forests lies in the human thirst for adventure and the unknown.
These places challenge our understanding of the natural world, and they tantalize us with the possibility of experiencing something truly otherworldly. They beckon the bold to step away from the mundane and peer into the shadows of the unexplained. However, the danger in these adventures is very real. These forests are not just the settings of ghost stories. They are delicate ecosystems and culturally significant sites. It's crucial to approach them with respect for the local customs and the natural habitat that sustains them. Remember, curiosity can lead to adventure, but in these forests, it may also lead to peril. Tread carefully.